roughly the size of Spain, Darfur has a population of 8 million people. More than half of them, about 4.6 million, used to receive WFP food. That was at the height of the conflict, when there were massive displacements. But the situation has changed now, and the World Food Programme has to tailor its programmes to support that change. WFP is increasingly shifting its programmes to more targeted assistance, to build the resilience of the people of Darfur, so they can get back on their feet and need not rely solely on external assistance. In selected camps around Darfur, the World Food Program has begun implementing a cash and voucher program, replacing WFP food with local produce, giving people the choice to buy their preferred local food, empowering the beneficiaries, and strengthening the markets and traders' capacities. But for most internally displaced people, finding work to provide for their families is still an ongoing challenge. To help women generate income, WFP, in partnership with the Network for Women's Development, consisting of 57 smaller community-based organizations, have set up safe access to fuel and energy centers around Darfur. The consumption of less wood is protecting not only the environment, but the women, who used to travel long distances at risk of violence to collect firewood. Originally a project aimed at building fuel-efficient stoves from locally available material, safe centers have quickly transformed into platforms for much more. Women from neighboring villages learn to make fire fuel briquettes, nurseries, tree plantations, while also receiving training in nutrition, adult literacy and hygiene. Selected women are promoted to become trainers themselves, so they in turn can train other members of their community. مركزاً <تصفيق> من ناحية التعليم والبيئة والثقافة المرأة في دارفور المرأة في دارفور هو البرع الأطفال المرأة بقى هو الأم والمرأة بقى الأب وفي قاعد إلا المرأة بفتش العكل للإيال بفتش الشراب للإيال المرأة يوم كامل شغال الراجل ما بيجيب حاجة إلا المرأة هس شغل ده لو كان الرجال الرجال ما بعمله إلا النسوان Since WFP began shifting their strategy two years ago, 1.2 million people are no longer in need of WFP assistance. Community-based organizations and networks have substantially built their capacities, and universities and local governments are now conducting research, monitoring and evaluations together with WFP throughout Darfur. Based on these successes, new interventions continue to be introduced supporting and creating links between the projects, providing a holistic approach to addressing the challenges of food security in Darfur.